Hi, Jackie. Hi, how are you? Um, fine. People don't know this, but I, I met Jackie a few years ago, and uh, um, we've, we, we actually were at a conference together. I think that's where we first met, right? Yeah, we met at um, the uh, diversity conference in 2017, yeah, actually, November wow. 2017. Yeah, yeah we roomed together. That was really great. So yeah. I know you, but I'm going to pretend I don't know you because I don't know what you've been up to over 2020 because that's been a really... Wow. Surviving, Jackie. I've been surviving. Yeah, yeah. Like, so, I've been surviving, uh, actually. Uh, it's, 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 it's interesting. Yeah, that, that so tell thing. me tell me about what you've been doing in 2020. Okay, so, um, well, for those who don't know AfroCrowd, uh, our focus is the African diaspora, people of African descent on Wikipedia, both in content and editorship, um, you know, increasing awareness and engagement um, in the wiki community, um, that it exists at all, that there is a wiki community and they're welcome to join. Um, but also um, in helping to um, uh, improve uh, information about people of African descent, um, if there are any gaps or if there are any uh, hidden figures, or also in, in some cases, if, if the information could be improved um, or, or just increasing awareness about um, sometimes what different groups are doing um, throughout the movement and how people can get involved. And um, so we have been, uh, over the last year, um, uh, well, I would say from, uh, you know, when the world changed from about March to now, um, and it's still, we're in the throes of it still, uh, of the pandemic, we've been doing a lot of um, uh, more internal work. We've been uh, doing webinars. We've been holding conferences online. Um, uh, we ha have been um, in increasing in our, 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 our participation with partners like Wikimedians of the Caribbean, which, uh, as you know, I'm, um, uh, I help lead that group, and I'm also um, uh, very involved in. And, uh, uh, and also, we've connected with um, uh, News on Wiki um, and that campaign with Pete. And, uh, and I'm also um, in that as well. And, um, but one of uh, the highlights for me has been um, engaging everyone and just finding how everyone's doing uh, in different parts of the world, um, uh, you know, dealing with COVID-19. And we um, connected with people from, you know, all over the place about, you know, how are you doing during COVID-19 and, and kind of helping to, um, uh, add information about that um, from different countries. So um, we we enjoy that that kind of work as, as well, like reaching out with other partners. But um, with all, everything that's been happening in 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 the world with unrest, um, you know, concerning uh, protests, um, especially around the time uh, over the summer, um, we usually hold something called Juneteenth, and this would have been our, I think, would have been our third year doing it. Um, and usually it would be um, just the focus of, of Juneteenth, which mm -hmm. is the uh, celebration of the emancipation of enslaved people in America. And, um, and uh, it would come uh, as uh, usually just one event. We would have uh, an in-person event where we would um, write about anything from slavery to civil rights, et cetera. And this year, we, it turned out um, uh, it, it was right around the time of, 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 of some of the peak of people's um, uh, thoughts around what was happening in the news in that time. So we held a conference um, uh, instead, uh, focused on civil rights for about three days. Right. And uh, we had, uh, uh, today we would have had Alexandria Lockett with us and she um, uh, asked her to speak at the event and, and be our keynote and she was amazing. And mm -hmm. you guys missed out because she was, uh, she was a real great person to hear. And, um, and from there, we focused on uh, uh, civil rights in Wikipedia. And, um, and that from there um, caused us to connect with others who are also interested in the topic. We connected with the Latino, Afro-Latino community, the Dominican uh, group we had over the summer. Then we connected with people at NPR and, um, uh, and the global Situation Room um, and NYULA and um, Young Entertainment Advocates for 
um, our event on uh, BIPOC community, Black and Indigenous populations, uh, people of color. And it just kept going from there. We, we connected with uh, NYULA again for an entire week of editing. Mm -hmm. And um, which to this day, uh, you know, uh, continues to, to, um, to expand even more. So we've been busy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely not a time to slow down. It sounds like y'all had great events. Are there videos that anybody could catch up on those events? If... Yes. Okay, yes. tell me about that. So um, we've got uh, some more coming out. We redid our um, our website um, at the beginning of, of all of this, actually a little bit before. Um, I am uh, actually the new um, uh, uh, director of AfroCrowd. So was getting situated with that when all this started. Um, and uh, on our page, we're gonna be having some more videos, afrocrowd.org. Um, and uh, we're also expecting to put out some more on YouTube. So mm -hmm. from here, you can just search Afrocrowd and you can find our videos and you can from this year and, uh, and, and before. And we also have um, a suite of um, tutorials to show you how to edit Wikipedia. Um, um, it's, it's very focused on um, exactly what we do, which is um, we focus on the African diaspora. Um, and, and, and by the way, because we're women run, um, the founder, Alice Backer, and I um, uh, thought it would be important to highlight women as well, since, um, you know, that's a number that could be included as well. Um, partners like uh, Women in Red, for example, we, we partnered with them for the BIPOC event to also focus on women. Um, so that's an aside. But yeah, anything you want to find out about us is online on YouTube. We're on Instagram. Just search hashtag AfroCrowd. Mm -hmm. And on Twitter, we're AfroCrowd IP. And then you can also go to our website, AfroCrowd.org. But if you want a video of us, if you want tutorials, if you want anything like that, you can find us. Because we want to find you. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, so... Our next event is actually um, in February, February uh, 21st. Uh, we're going to be at the Schomburg again, and we're going to be joining with some students um, in the online community, and uh, we're going to be holding our annual Black History Month event um, um, on that day. I believe it's from 1.30 to 5, so Eastern time. So if anyone is interested, you know, we're there. And uh, obviously, uh, if you just have any interest at all, uh, we're, we're looking for you and we'd, we'd love to chat. Mm -hmm. Now, time's running short for us here. Uh, I just want to reach uh, one thing. And I have um, for the volume that I co-edited with Joseph Regal, uh, Alexandra Lockett, she wrote a chapter. So she's, she's amazing. And you're right. She's an incredible speaker. Um, so I am, that's why I just, I just, love everything she has to say. She actually is teaching, um, she teaches using Wikipedia at Selman College, which is uh, an all women's college, HBCU as well. Um, so an historically oh, black yeah, college yeah. university for anyone who might not know my, sorry, my higher ed lingo, um, but just really amazing. And she talks about in her chapter about um, the authorship um, that she has to deal with um, her black women students coming in and saying, why do I have the authority to edit this page? So going with that, how do you, how do you encourage people and how do you overcome that? Because I know authorship and who has the right to create knowledge and edit knowledge is a huge thing that's, that's a social thing that I always like to discuss and, and bring up because some people don't actually think about that. So could you talk about that for a minute? Of course, it's one of our favorite myths to dispel. Um, uh, from anyone who, who comes to our events, whether it's online, in person, back in the day, it feels like 100 years ago, um, is that you um, that that it Wikipedia is still open to everyone and of any background, any language, and that you can join in the telling of your story, in, of the, the story of the world, mm -hmm. and um, and and that history. So um, what we enjoy doing is once you come in, we start everybody from scratch. We've had people who don't even know how to, um, uh, who have a hard time uh, with navigating a computer, but yet they are a lawyer or a PhD. And 
Um, or we've had, uh, we've had students, we've had teachers, you know, we've had uh, events that are focused on all different kinds of themes. But the crux is, is that, um, you know, we'll, we'll start where you are and then we'll go on the journey together. And um, we, when they do their first edit, when you have a Wikipedian that does their first edit, um, it's really, and they really get excited. They're like, oh, wait a minute, this is live? Yeah, it's like the whole world can see it. <laughs> you know, you get the real one. It's, it's not like a fake one that you start with. So it's cool. And I just want to give a shout out to all the volunteers who help us do this. We, we started in New York as a meetup. And now we've had people who, who joined us all over the world. And uh, we're especially thankful for people like you, Jackie, who make an effort to try and um, uh, I know your work on on uh, systemic bias, and I've come to some of your other things. Um, and also for anyone out there who has um, taken the time to to um, help other people or to join us at our events. Um, Africrad was five years old uh, this last year, and in February will be six years old. So um, we're happy to keep on going. We've had one edit a on a month since 2015, almost every yes. month. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Not I know that's a lot. Time. That's a lot of planning. Congratulations. Congratulations on that. That's amazing. Well, thank you for for chatting with me. And I miss you. Big hugs, of course. Uh, I miss uh, miss the wiki events. So can't wait till we can all get together again. Thank you. Mm -hmm.